What is going on guys and today I am here with a Houston Rockets building a dynasty video here on NBA 2K16 and the Rockets were a very highly suggested team and the Raptors so don't worry the Raptors will be next or in the next one we'll see um but they'll be very quick um they'll be um they'll come up shortly but with the Rockets here um the thing is um really James Harden is where we're building this team around um, we have a nice piece in Clint Capella right there. Beverly and Ty Lawson are just like, eh. Same with, like, Terrence Jones and Josh Smith, really. And I gotta trade Dwight Howard, because I'm not bringing him back, and he always hits free agency, so there'd be no point in getting nothing back for him. So I'm gonna just throw him up on the block, see what I can get for him, and it's $22 million salary, because honestly, I'll take anything. I can get Kevin Love. Okay, that's interesting. DeAndre Jordan. Okay. Honestly, I never get Kevin Love. I think I'm going to do the Kevin Love trade. Alright. Uh, I don't want to give up KJ, though. I'd rather... Cavs would be calling $2 million. Will you give me Mozgov? And I'll give you Ty Lawson? Nope, Dan. That's not going to work. Uh, Beverly? No. Terrence Jones. I'll do this trade because I'm not... Are you kidding me? Um... Alright, give me freaking, um, they don't have Varejo, I forgot, they have Channing Fry now, but I don't want Channing Fry. Give me Mo Williams. And, of course, they can't do that. Uh, so, Mozgov then, and I gotta give you a good player on a cheap salary, which, uh, Josh Smith? I don't want to give up a first round pick. I'll do this trade, though. 2018 first round pick. Alright, you know what? I'll do this trade. So there we go. We get Kevin Love on the team. Don't know who's going to... I guess Clint Capella is going to play center. We'll let the CPU adjust it. So it's Beverly, Harden, Ariza, Love. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, we just got Mozgov, of course. J.R. Smith, Capella, uh, Jones, Lawson. So that's all I'm going to make for now, uh, trade-wise. And yeah, so that'll be it for me. And I'll see you guys at the end of the season. Alright, guys. The regular season just ended. KD wins MVP. Carl Anthony Towns, Rookie of the Year. Tim Duncan, Sixth Man of the Year. Anthony Davis, Defensive Player of the Year. CJ McCollum was improved. Billy Donovan, Coach of the Year. It seems like it's the same thing every time. That's all NBA first team. James Harden of our team makes all NBA second team. Um, did Kevin Love make any of these? I don't think so. Yep. Uh, did Sam Decker make an all-rookie team? No, he did not. Um, all right. So we throughout the whole year, we were the fifth seed. And the last, like, stretch of the regular season, we just, uh, like, did so bad. And we ended up being the 8th seed. Uh, Love had, an, um, I guess, a good year. Uh, same with Harden. Um, Ariza was alright. Same with JR, Mozgov. Uh, I'm gonna let the coaching do it. They better be giving Harden only 35. We gotta give Harden, like, um, uh, let's give Harden 37. I don't even know. Alright, so... We're taking enough under. I don't expect much. We won game one. Okay. Okay, we are up two games to zero. What happened? All right, we won by 15 here. Love and Harden and JR. Wow, okay. And then this game, Harden just went off and we, I don't know, Westbrook and Katie both had triple doubles, but that wasn't enough. Game. Oh my god, are we going to sweep them? No way. Oh, okay, they win. Oh no. Oh, Jesus. Game 7. <laughs> okay, yep. I, we were up three games to none. Please don't blow this. Oh, man. We were up three games to zero on the Thunder, and we blow it. Alright. And Portland made the 14. Okay. Uh -huh. But it looks like the Bucks. Wow, make it to the NBA Finals. That's cool. Um, But the Thunder, who beat us, go on to win it. KD, Finals MVP. Uh, Bob Weiss retires as a coach. None of you care. Brian Garnett, Pierce, Allen, and Nash all head into the Hall of Fame. Uh, we don't have any lottery picks, so I'm going to skip over the drift lottery. Go to staff signing. See if we need to sign a head coach. Um, yeah, I'm just going to try to sign a head coach. Um, Greg Popovich, I wish. I wish it was easier to sign head coaches in this. And I'll offer... Is Tyran Wu here? I always want to get Tyrant. Alright, and I'll offer, like, Frank Vogel, because he's probably a guy. And I'm only going to go after uh, head coach. I don't care about the other spots. They're all tentative, and they all reject. So I'm not surprising there. I'm going to end up with, like, Elijah Nelson and William Goodrich, uh, the auto January guys that are pretty good. Um, They're mowing. 
They're mulling and uh, B minus. I'll say Goodrich. All right, so there we go. There's our head coach. Uh, let's decline him. Sign. All right. And I just signed the wrong coach. I wanted to sign Goodrich. I'm, I'm so dumb. All right. So NBA draft. I'm pretty sure we have our first round pick. Um. Uh, if this sim actually, I want to trade Patrick Beverly before. Um, and actually try to trade some other people to clear up cap space for a free agency. Um, so first one's going to be Beverly. I'm going to see what I can get for him on the market. Um, I can get the 25th pick. CJ Watson. Frank Kaminsky is not that bad. JJ Barrett. Tony Allen. Uh, I think I'll take Frank Kaminsky. Why not? Uh, Two-star trade value is not bad. And now I'm going to look to see what I can get for Ariza. Uh, but if I can't get a lot, I won't trade Ariza because he's a good player um to have but i'm gonna see what i can get for him and maybe clear up his eight million dollar salary um bogdan savalosha nick young dante cunningham brown netto uh will allen's interesting for defensive purposes but now nah, we're just gonna keep a reason for now all right so nba drift what picks do i have i have i don't even have a first round pick all right well i guess i'm skipping over it then um i know sometimes you guys actually can I trade Ariza for a pick? Like, can I trade Ariza, like, Montrez Harrell and this first rounder for, like, a first rounder this year, maybe? Um, no team is offering. What if I went to, like, the, like, the 18th pick uh, from someone or something like that? 15. What can I get for this? All right, I don't have anything. Uh, not even, like, nope, I don't want your second round pick next. Um... What about this Nuggets pick? I would have to give up Kevin Love. All right, so it looks like I'm skipping over the draft this year. Don't want to bother with that. Then uh, Ty Lawson, we are definitely going to decline. And Clint Capella, we are definitely going to bring back. All these people decline their deals. Um, how funny would that be if I brought back Dwight? Um, honestly, I might. <laughs> like, it's 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 out there. I could possibly do it. Uh, Terrence Jones, I'm pretty sure, is a restricted free agent. So my free agents, J.R. Smith's testing. Everyone's testing. Terrence Jones, I will definitely offer you that. Ty Lawson, honestly, I'll offer you that too. So, let's head into free agency. Signing these people. We have $21 million in cap space. That's enough for a decent player. Obviously, not enough for LeBron. Uh, Drummond, is it enough? Oh, okay. I would definitely want Drummond on this team. Player option. I can't give him a no-trade clause. All right. I offered Drummond a deal. And we are one of his worst. Oh, damn it. Ah, he probably wanted that fourth year. I wish I could withdraw it. Um, if not, I'm going to go after Al Horford, um, and I'll offer Whiteside. Like, there's plenty of centers out here. I don't even have enough for Dwight. Al Jefferson, I'll also offer. Power forward, we don't need. Small forward, we do need. Um, Joe Johnson, I would not mind offering a one-year deal. Shooting guard, we don't need, obviously. And Clarkson, maybe Rondo, I'll offer. Jennings, I'll offer. And Ishmith. Everyone loves some Ishmith on their team. So, we get... Damn it, Horford and Drummond accept other offers. I'm not going to accept those people just yet. Horford goes to the Pelicans. That's pretty scary with... Oh, I get Whiteside. All right, I'm going to bring Whiteside here. And Jennings or Ishmith. Um... Oh, I don't even have enough for any of them. All right, but we're bringing Whiteside on the team. I am happy with that. And now I just got to accept people back that I bird rights with, which is Mozgov and JR. And then that will fill up our roster spots. If Mozgov will accept our deal, hopefully he does. And there we go. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to simulate here. It's a free agency. I'm at player progression. And we'll see what they do. Uh, player progression, we got Harden at a 93. Whiteside at an 85. Love at an 83. Capella went up to a 78. Same with Kaminsky. All right, we have too many centers. That's who I'm definitely going to try to trade at the start of the regular season. But, yeah, so I'll see you guys at the start of the regular season. Alright guys, I'm here at the start of the regular season. I gotta trade one of these centers. I think I'm gonna look at Kaminsky's value on the trading block. Um, hopefully, I actually should have threw him and maybe Trevor Ariza up to see what I could have gotten for them to maybe a better small forward. Um, but let's see what I can get. Um, if the offers aren't good, I'm gonna just go back and see what I can get with Ariza. Jay Crowder is interesting, but I am no way giving up Whiteside. Jeff Green? Ooh, that's kind of interesting. Ah, Jeff Green, Jeff Green. Not bad stats last year. Kemba Walker, okay, um, he would be perfect, uh, I would have to send him back to his original team, could I give up Ty Lawson, 
They would be calling it three million. Do you have a really bad salary dude you want to give up? Definitely Marjanovic. Actually, you want to give us back now? Um, does Marjanovic have any trade value now? How would we be calling a ten million? Oh, we're calling three million over the cap anyway. Um. Do you want Mozgov too? And then you probably got to keep 13 players. So just give me Aaron Harris. Two-star trade value for Aaron Harrison. Okay. Uh, Dante Cunningham. And the Hornets would still have too many players. So then you just got to give me Alex Ajinka. No, you cannot give me Alex Ajinka. Then you got to give me DeLon Wright. <sighs> then you got to give me Aaron Harrison. And I will give you my first round pick. I ain't giving you white side. All right, let's decline that trade then. Um, Gallinari. Um, what if I did? Where the hell is Ariza? Ariza is a seventy-four overall. Damn, he's falling off. Um, but yeah. So let's see what I can get for these two: Robert Covington, Bobby J. Crowder. I think I might do that trade. And so, Jeff Teague, okay. Can I get Kemba for this deal? Because I really want Kemba, actually. But I honestly, I am actually really happy with Jeff Teague. Uh, what do I do? G, Crowder, and Selinger. Uh, now, we'll do Jeff Teague and Mike Scott for Kaminsky, Ariza, and that. Unless you have a better small forward you want to give me. Savalosha, Evan Turner. Would you give me Evan Turner over Mike Scott? I am not giving you Clint Capella. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I will, okay, I'll do that trade. So, we get, uh, Jeff T on the team. So, it's Teague, Harden, Turner, Love, Whiteside, Capella. This is a really good lineup. First scoring option, that, and then we'll just do Teague. Alright, so that'll be for me, and I'll see you guys at the end of the regular season. Alright, guys, so I'm here at the end of the regular season. KD wins MVP. Ben Simmons of the Sixers wins Rookie of the Year. Tim Duncan, okay, wins Sixth Man of the Year again. AD wins, uh, Defensive Player of the Year. D'Angelo Russell, Most Improved. And our coach, Eliza Nelson, there we go, wins Coach of the Year. Um, did we make any of these teams? Um, Reggie Jackson? Wow, okay. Nicholas Batum? Wow, okay. <laughs> um, I guess Harden didn't win it because I guess his minutes were down, probably. There's Dwight Howard on the Celtics. Um, Deonta Davis. Um, Alright, so... We'll see, uh, I'll show you guys, we did very well. Second seed above the Thunder, 16, uh, 3 and 19. Harden, 22 points a game. Love had a nice, uh, year. Same with Teague. And then Whiteside was just, eh, he didn't really even do that well rebounding. Um, but let's adjust these. So it's Teague, I want to give more minutes to Teague. So Udra is definitely getting, like, 8 minutes. Lawson can get like 18, uh, 17 actually. Capella can get 25. Alright, so here we go. Harden 36 good. Whiteside 33. We'll give 34 to 35 to Love. We'll give 37 to Harden and we'll just give the rest to Teague. Turner can get that little mess. Alright, so round one against the Kings. Okay, they went 41 and 41. We win game one. We should be able to sweep them actually. Who's even on their team? The okay, <laughs> they had a LeBron James. Um... And he's carrying this team. Cousins is Cousins is really disappointing in the playoffs, it looks like. Uh, but we sweep them. There we go. Alright. So we're taking on the Thunder. This they beat us last year, but we have a much better team. 1-1. 2-1 one, one, one us. 2-2. Two, 3-2 two, two us. No, game seven again. Can we not lose? Damn it. No, okay. Yes, we win by seven. Turner, Harden, Love, Terrence Jones, let's go. And we're going to the Western Conference Finals to take on the Pelicans, who I know have... All right, we win game one, but they have Al Horford, I remember, yeah. And they have Tyson Chandler, Ryan Anderson, Anthony Davis, of course. And they still have Evans and Drew Holiday. So, we win game one. We win game two. We win game three. They win game four. And we're going to the NBA Finals to take on the Rockets, and we... Did I just say the Rockets? The Raptors, who are pretty much going to be my next building a dynasty. And in game one, James Harden triple doubled. Good shit. Uh, Dave DeRozan, they added Kyle Korver. Uh, Donald Sloan. Oh, they added Rudy Gobert. That's a good addition. All right. Did they trade Valanciunas or they still have him? No, they still have him. All right. So game two, we win. Game three, we win. Game four, there we go. And we win a title in year two. Um, 
and we're just gonna see if we can start this dynasty up win another title next year james harden finals mvp uh george carl retires tim duncan and vince carter do as well draft lottery i'm gonna skip over same with staff signings and i'm just gonna skip to the nba draft and i'm actually gonna try to trade up to get a decent player um don't draft josh hart okay right, good to know uh we probably have the last pick but i want to see if i can trade up could i trade my 30th overall pick and Beno Udra and maybe Ty nah, and Corey Brewer for like the 12th pick and a player. Um, Goran Dragic, I give. I'm not giving up white side. Um, all right. Well, I'm obviously gonna have to just do this manually. All right, 10th pick, sons. Who do you want? White side, no. Turner, white side, of. What I do this trade for the 10th pick and Dwight Powell? I don't think I would. So let's see if I can maybe get like the 16th pick. Who's got the 16th? Nope, not the Kings. Um, who the hell on earth has the 16th pick? Ah, uh, man. All right, who? Oh, uh, we'll do the Hawks at 14. Evan Turner and a first. Could I give him Jr. and a first? Ty Lawson and a first. Yep, and I get David West. I will take that deal so i'll see you guys when i'm ready to make my pick at 14. all right guys i'm making my pick here at 14 and i'm pretty sure like thon maker just went what the f what the hell i would oh i didn't realize that would have been such a cool addition i could take isaiah hardenstein or justin jackson could i like trade my pick on the trade finder and see if they offer me thon maker uh who is it the nuggets would the nuggets offer me him no, I don't think so. All right, so let's make my pick. Um, I'm either gonna take this Isaiah guy back a power forward from Germany or Justin Jackson. Um, I think I'm gonna take Isaiah because uh, Justin Jackson's a 72, really wouldn't help, and maybe Isaiah Hardenstein could be maybe like a 76. So I'm gonna draft him, and I'll see you guys at rookie signings. All right, guys. So, um, weird thing happened. My game crashed. Um, you might have saw if I showed that to you guys. But my game crashed, I come back, and then I drafted Lonzo Ball at the 14th pick as that Isaiah Hardenstein guy was gone. And I didn't really want to show you guys again. Um, and it was taking forever. Alright, so there's some actually nice free agents, but I don't think I'm going to have any cap space to sign any of them. <laughs> Said we, uh, Jeff Teague, I definitely want to bring back. And Mike Scott, I do not mind. I have bird rights on Teague, so I'm good there. Um, and yeah, we got to bring him back anyway. I would have enough cap space to sign a different port card. Greg went. All right, so this free agent class is all right. Noel, Monroe, Old Depot, Parsons, Rose, Diang. Do I have bird rights on anybody here? No. Um, yeah, I don't think I have to worry about anyone. Do I have to get a roster spot? No, I have plenty. All right, so let's simulate to player progression here. And then I don't think I'm going to make a trade. Yeah, because we got starting point guard, Teague, shooting guard, Harden. And we have Smith off the bench. We have Turner, small forward. Power forward, we got Love. And then, and Terrence Jones in center. This is the center duo with White Town and Capella. So that'll be for me now. And I'll see you guys at the start of next year's playoffs. All right, guys. I'm here at the end of the season. KD wins MVP once again. Dennis Smith when, wins um, Rookie of the Year. Cameron Payne, six man. Anthony Davis, defensive player of the year. Kyle Anderson, most improved. And our coach of the year, Elijah Nelson, wins coach of the year. Um, just looking for any Rockets, maybe. Wow, Dennis Smith, all NBA second team already. Um, all right, no Rockets here. I don't think on anything. So, but we almost set the NBA like record for wins in the season: seventy-one and eleven, thirty-eight and three at home, thirty-three and eight on the road. We ended the year on an eight-game winning streak. Ah, uh, this team was good. Harden, 20, uh, 24 points. Love, 16. Whiteside had only 8 rebounds again, which is kind of worrying me. But, but combined with him and Capella, they had like 17 about. Teague had uh, 7 assists. I'm surprised Harden had more, actually. So let's just let the CPU adjust the lineups. Mike Scott can get 10, actually. Um, yeah, and I'd just rather give... I'll give him 38. I'm going to just give the rest to Teague. Um, I want to make Teague the third scoring option again. All right, so game one against the Spurs, we win game two, we win game three, we win game four, we win. All right, nice easy sweep. We are dominating the NBA. Okay, we lose to the Pelicans game one, we win game two, they win game three, we win game four, we win game five. Okay, almost a scare there, and we're taking on the Warriors. Game one, we win. Game two, we win. Game 
three we lose, game four we lose, game five we win, game six we win, and we're going to the NBA Finals to take on the Sixers, who have Goran Dragic, Ben Simmons, Monroe, Okafor. That team is nice. And B, Buddy Heald, um, impressive team they have put together. Game one, we win. Game two, we win. Game three, they win. Game four, they win. Game five, we win. Game six, they win. All right, game seven. Let's simcast this. Oh, no. No, we're falling behind. No, they're going to beat us. And we were just falling short of becoming a dynasty almost. But going to back-to-back -back titles was pretty well. And almost setting the NBA record for wins of the season is impressive um, as itself. So this was the team that lost, um, sadly, Game 7 of the NBA Finals. Harden, Whiteside, Love, T, Capella, Smith, Terrence Jones, Evan Turner, Sam Decker, Corey Brewer, Benno Uja, Mike Scott, David West, Alonzo Ball, Perry, and Perry Dozier. Uh, the final MVP, if you were curious, will be... Jaheel Ogavor, I definitely said his name wrong, I always do, or it's still real, you know, you know what, I'm bad at that, I'm getting in the video here, so, we will like if you enjoyed, um, yeah, so that'll be for me, and I'll see you guys in the next video.